Hello and welcome back to Let's Play 2 2013. This is 2K. This is USPW episode 10. The USPW American Wrestling show right after the pay-per-view, which was not good. So let's let's see if we can recoup some of that loss. Shall we? Let's see, we want three participants here, an alliance. Do we want to boast with the entertainment? I think s Nier is good at microphones, so we'll want him on the mic. And uh, Menace? For Mr. Rex. So, there we go. Where are you? Where are you, four-man group? Did I not do it? I know I did it. Oh. Okay. I was so lost. Shane, Jumbo, Corporate James Outlaw, T-Rex. So now we need another angle. We'll have Tyson Bain take out his anger on Sam Strong. Actually, take it out on Nikki Champion. After a big tag match with Jumbo and Corporate taking on Nikki Champion and number one contender Enigma. Open script, slow build, decisive. Actually, heels need to get some wins here. Especially new heels. Nicky can lose because he'll get his win back. Especially if he's attacked by Dyson Bane. Alright. Um. We'll have another menace based attack with this time T-Rex attacking Caulfield which will lead to what do we got for faces here let's say Datsun coming in to take on Black And Black getting a win. Open. Decisive. Big four on four match with Savage Fury and the Champs taking on the Cole Warriors. And the Towers of Power. And let's give Java the win. Still need 19 minutes. Need to have the ladies have a match. Hmm. 
Hmm. How do I want to do this? Andre and Cherry. Force and Melody. And I'd like to think uh, Melody came out with um, Force's face paint on and it was nuts. Cherry Bomb attacks Melody after so we got um heels versus faces let's see here brothers extreme Taking on that wouldn't be. How about it? Let's give the Keith twins a match to start off. Open, scripted, all out, decisive. Alright, so Peter Valentine still needs to lose. Drop down the card, Peter. Versus Mikey. On the pre-show, and Mikey gets the win. Oh, you know what we didn't do? What angle we didn't have was... Alright. We have a little... Alicia and Petra not getting a long segment. Alright, let's see how this show does. Ooh, nice. Mikey James. I was hoping that would be a little better. Nice for for basically two unknowns versus two has beens. I'll take that. He did better than this. Whew. All right, that continues. Oh, how sad! Novak's upset. The, the love life of Alicia Strong is it's such a such a wonder and then a big giant cluster of a match with uh ooh Peter Novak getting the getting defeated I can almost imagine him like <sighs> stomping around I'm sad um uh before taking the loss. Huh. I, I think I'm going to push forward with that as part of the storyline now. I didn't even mean for that to happen. Oh no, T-Rex destroys Chris Crawfield. That man has a family. By God. Wow, Greg Black, you've been disappointing me so far. Stop disappointing me. Wow, that main event had fucking nothing good going for it. Wow.
Jumbo Jackson, you just can't catch a break, can you? Ah, oh my God. He was broken in half. Yeah, lost us popularity because freaking Jumbo Jackson and James Outlaw don't have bloody... We need better heels. I thought bringing in Greg Black would help with that. Alright, well, here we go. Alright, we're going to try and do better. Probably going to drop to Colt. I'm going to actually let it run through so we can see tomorrow's headlines. And see if we drop to Colt. Gary on the chance. Parisian power, Gary on the chance is a Frenchman who works the European circuit. From 2004 until 2010, he worked a weird gimp gimmick, calling himself Minion and generally creeping the hell out of everyone. Having mercifully dropped the gimmick, he started to get serious about his career, hitting the gym religiously and bulking up. No, I just want to see. Oh, hey. They didn't drop. They'll drop, um. They'll drop to Colt at the end of the month when they get hit with their, um, penalty for losing the. the war. So, thanks for watching, and have a good one.